little bit closer I mean showing you this is my battery and this the positive and this is the negative my make is running now and it's 271 it's 271 volts yon mga yo off mga seconds na on we will show you the difference between an on and off off tatlong beses three times off hindi just one second siyang naka off 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 so 71 goes to 73 mga one second siyang uh, two seconds will off again Okay, so there is a two volts difference between on and off. So how many minutes now? It's one minute and two, one minute and twelve, fourteen. We'll check up to fifteen minutes, possible if we can. Uh, how long it will drop? How many? How many volts it will drop in fifteen seconds? So, ang saan siya nagtagal? 72? Ano ang saan nagsimula? 132. So, 10 minutes pa lang? Hindi, ano? 132. Ha? 132. Isang oras na. So, 7 minutes, 7, ah, 4 volts. Ano, 71 ito, 7 volts. So, 6,000 watts battery so if the load is 1,000 watts in this 6,000 will be reduce 80% of 6,000 watts something like 4,000 4,000 or just 80% that we can uh, use to power this light bulb but uh, the drops so it means the 1,000 watts in one hour the drop will be average in every minute of maybe 5 volts so almost 5 minutes now the, the drops still low not much, huh? maybe 0.5 only, less than 1 because it's still going to 7.271 this is my Meg, uh, I remind again uh, this is not the best tune up to tune a make to tune my to tune up my system takes a long process and uh, sometimes it needs to replace the parts. It will took me the I mean the perfect tune. It will 
took three days. So at this very moment, it's just to test the durability of the parts I'm putting in, but not properly tune up. So for the last three days since March 1, when we are testing with the SAS breakthrough on resistive load, we are changing a lot of parts before we increase, we jump to another level of capacity of load. So my target here to reach 2,000 watts at least, or 2,500 watts, before I will make it a perfect tune-up. So this dropping, I hope it will stay uh, on the same level once tune the right uh, pre resonant frequency so it's six minutes now still almost no change okay we will switch off and on again we'll see what how much the difference of the what two seconds different huh? no big difference but this is actual load directly to the battery but without my system without my make system the different I think it's more than 10 volt uh, no I think more than more than uh, 15 volts Actually, we keep changing parts uh, because some parts it's uh, not suitable to the capacity where I'm putting in or I'm loading in. So this 1,000 watts we already uh, changed two set of parts, two different set of parts, or I mean uh, two different set level of capacity or amperage. So if we are really look stable, and then that's the time we will jump to the 2,000 level, 2,000 watts level. Uh, this video is just representing you the actual what's happening on my R&D. If this start, if this testing will reach 24 hours without busted or overheating parts will go to a higher level but look uh, there is very small difference uh, it's now eight minutes more than eight minutes it's still almost 275 it's still uh, going to 271 i mean 271 this is a 220 bulbs and i'm supplying only 110 this is the same bulb i will just increase the voltage to, to reach a 2000 level Again, I, I repeat, this is a 6,000 uh, bank of battery. It's an AGM type for just testing. After after I figure it out that, I mean, the resonant tuning, parts not overheating, that's the time I will power up of my module, converter module, to be the power supply to be one part inside the battery because uh, if I have a converter it serves only few batteries maybe uh, two sets only six volt and six volt this low drops of bolts is not a big deal it's just a matter of tune up
than 10 minutes now but the drops is almost now this go to 69 so what I can say from 271 uh, it's only one bolt so. next video is to show you the actual 1000 watts battery how much uh, really the drain okay that's for this video and then uh, the other one will actual load load of 1000 directly to the battery we'll check how much really the bolts drops per minute